During last week, did you notice anyone has broken the rules in your department or office? Absent without informing, coming late to the office, mistakes in reports, poor performance. Did you notice how many people violated traffic rules when you were driving on last week? Did you notice how many people broke the rules in supermarket, train or even bus? Do you know the fact? More than half of the judgments we make on others are based on wrong assumptions. Today you are going to learn how to avoid making wrong assumptions on others. One day, an old father was traveling with his son by the train. Son was nearly 25 years of age. There was a young couple sitting next to the father. The boy was so curious about the atmosphere. He was standing, peeping out of the window with excitement and full of joy. Just like a little boy who travels in the train for the first time in life. This young boy was screaming with joy. The boy cried out to the father with excitement. Dad, look outside the window. All the trees are going to the other side. His old father took no notice that much, but had a light smile on his face. But the young couple got excited sitting next to him. They were talking to each other, saying, this matured stupid fellow, behaving like a little boy who travels in the train for the first time. They heard the boy screaming out again. Dad, see we are passing all the houses behind. The old father was just as the same as earlier. The young couple got more excited and furious. And they were talking to each other. This stupid fellow would have taken to the hospital. See this stupid old man doesn't take any action over the childish behavior of his son. Then they heard the third screaming of the boy. Dad, looks in the sky. All the clouds are coming with us. The young couple lost their patience at once at this time and he screamed to the old father. Why don't you take your child to a hospital? The old father with tears in his eyes looked slowly at the young couple and said, Yes, ma'am. We are coming from the hospital. My son was blind when he was born. Today only he got the eyesight. That's why he's so excited. My dear friend, often times in our life we make wrong assumptions. We make wrong assumptions on people around us. When we are at home, when we are on the road, when we are at work, school, temple, church or any other place. When a person cuts the queue in the bank or supermarket, we say he or she doesn't have the discipline. But the reality might be she wants to go to a school to pick a child before it becomes too late. When a driver suddenly overtakes us, we say he or she is an indisciplined driver who doesn't obey the road rules. But the reality may be he or she wants to rush to the hospital to see the dying mother suffering from the cancer. When a child continually becomes poor in studies, a teacher may say he is miserable and may label him as a mentally retarded person. But the actual situation may be that this poor child comes to his school skipping the morning meal to save money for his mother. Maybe he has lost his father or mother. Maybe the reason that he doesn't have money to buy books. Think about any person who has been labeled as wrong according to your assumptions. How do you know your assumptions are true? You may be naming a woman as a prostitute. The whole society must have labeled like that. You may be arguing that you have enough pieces of evidence to prove that. I'm telling you, you might be completely wrong. Because you know why? Every one of us is having a story for our behavior. 
which is known only to us. She may be behaving like that because that's the only way she can afford food for her children who are deserted by the father. Maybe her husband is a drug addict. We make assumptions based on our belief system. It may come from our parents, teachers, culture, religion, friends or even neighbors. See how people fight each other based on religious matters, cultural matters, political matters because of the wrong assumptions. Here's the take home message for you. Be vigilant about your assumptions. Do not hesitate to make judgments on other people even the evidence seems obvious. Think on the other side. It doesn't matter even the whole world is only one side. I hope this video had value to your life. Hope to see you soon. Hi, this is Kitsiri. Hope you get great value from this video. Please share and like this video, comment below and subscribe to my channel. I'll offer you more videos like this to improve your personal and professional life.